All praise, all praise to the Most High in Christ. We just want to commend these brothers for bringing this news forward. Uh, at first, I thought when I started looking, I said, well, I think my general, he's a little behind on this news. But what, he, what he's bringing out is pretty dynamic. And it just gives me an opportunity to teach civics. Civics, that's all I'm doing is teaching civics. I'm not tearing anybody down, just trying to stop any Israelite from teaching. I learned from these guys. But I have been called to teach civics. Why? For the simple reason is a lot of our people won't be free until they understand that God ordained, ordained them to be free and he even left laws for us to uphold. Uphold, we got to uphold our human rights, our human rights. And one of the human right laws is that no, if you're free, you no, no man can cause you to be subject to his will for you, unless you move into his jurisdiction, jurisdiction territory. You move into his territory, and that's God. When God said, "All men," He gave Adam dominion over all the earth. And one of my videos, I was kind of teasing. You know, all men have dominion over all the earth at the same time. It's going to be chaos. But what he, what, what, what I meant is. And, you know, we all have dominion over our own paradigm, our own world. That's why, that's why the word world is so controversial. Because every man is the leader of his own world in God's eyesight. When he gave the man dominion, he didn't give him dominion over every other man, just over his world. He protects. It's sort of like his... Um, uh, 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 what you I say? Will trust under your trust? That's what trust is about, right? Everything, everybody, everybody, and everything that belongs to you is un, is in your trust. You take care of it. Your name, your stamp, your ring, your signet is over it. You're not supposed to rule over other people's paradigm. That's why God called earth given into the hands of the wicked is because people took their, made themselves ruler over other men's paradigm, over their world. That's what the popes and that's what this system is set up to rule over other people. That's wicked. That is wicked, right? Because God gave every man his own, his own piece of the earth. I don't have the right to come over your land and take your land. So, like, like, uh, let's let's listen to what the bishop, what the what the general is saying, because he's talking about civics here, he's talking about freedom of speech, rights, the rights. You don't have rights if you are in another man's paradigm. You have put yourself under his trust. Okay, so we have put ourselves under the United States trust and. And, and this woman here, she put herself under their trust when she went to that Jewish school and got a job. She put herself under herself under their trust. That's that's their stuff, you know. But now they're going to use they're going to use uh, the rights of freedom freedom of speech. They're going to use they're going to use their right to control their paradigm to make us think that they control freedom of speech. They got General scared in and he said, they gonna get rid of, they get rid of the college campus. No, the college campus is their paradigm. You gotta stay out of their world, man. That's what we're trying to tell you. They're, they're, so they're taking, they're taking to make these people out of an example. What those people, if they were really not white supremacists and alphabet people, they would have said, listen, I'm in your world. This is your paradigm. You can do what you want to in this school. You're going to fire me, but you're not going to tell me that uh, I don't understand uh, a two-way crime here. Your people are criminals. 
And she couldn't say that. Yeah. <laughs> but that's what should have been said is that you both are wrong. You know, you don't own the earth, lady. You know, your people do not own the earth. You in another world. I'm working for you and that's the only thing going on here. You're going to terminate my contract. Nothing else. You have no other power over, over the people on the earth. Except for you can terminate that contract with that paper fake money you got. You stole all the gold. We don't need gold. All we have to do is go back to bordering. Bordering. You guys, I got this. You, you got that. I need some of that. You need some of this. You know, when we do that, we'll get rid of this devilish system. And that's all we got to do. Keep the laws of the Most High, and we'll get rid of this devil. We'll get rid of this devil. I want to hear one just, just uh, window in, this little small window of what the general was saying to kind of show y'all what I'm talking about. Stop it from even harming the officers. Damn. Okay. Let's take the Several others, including North Carolina, North Dakota, Tennessee, Texas, and Florida, have pro pro prohibited mandatory DEI training. They don't want no free speech and diversity on no damn college campus. Right. They want to decide what the hell the scenario is, and they want everybody else to shut the hell up. See, the problem is, what confuses us too, we think we have the right to go in another man's world and, and take our, our uh our rules to take our rules man hey you better treat me right in your world no you play by my group my no you can't go in another nation's world and tell them now they are the Edomite nation they set it up to make it look diverse over here some over here you got this going on over there it's all cut up no it's one thing it's one pie they only have jurisdiction in their own world and if you go in their world and start working for them be employed by them then you gotta follow their rules, and they and they're gonna do what they got, want to do with you because you don't have a nation to come back and fight for you. So why would y'all stupid selves go sign a contract with the devils? You don't have an army. The Most High ain't with you when you do that. Five hundred one C three, lady working for uh bubble eyed. Uh, look at them glasses she got on, man. Look at her, man. The Most High is making a, 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 a crash dummy out of you people, man. He told y'all not to go over and sign them contracts with them. Now, we supposed to be gathering the people up. This is a good way to show the people that what I just talked to you about. And until we become a nation and join our trust together, the United States, join our trust together, our right to be on the earth, our inherited our inherited property, we got to join them together and stand with these people and say, unless y'all telling us that y'all going to stop us from existing on earth like you did the rest, like you did them, then that's the only way we're going to gather together, man. Y'all think it's going to be some other way. It ain't. We got to gather together and stand against the wicked and stand against the wicked, like stand up against them and say, okay, God, you got to fight for us. We got to go against this Red Sea. It looks scary. But we got to do it. We need a man to lead us into that. That's what Hosea is talking about. First chapter, 10th verse. We need a man to lead us into that to that point right there. And, and until we get ready, all of us ready to go into that, man, they're going to beat the hell out of us up in here. They was digging tunnels, man. These, man, these rats was digging tunnels, man, like rats, man. This is, you know, we messing with the devil, man. This is the devil. The synagogue, man. The chief worship house is where Dracula lives. It's where Freddy Krueger lives. It's where Jason lives, man. Man, come on, man. So, you hear what the general said? And I wonder if that's why now y'all now y'all really... Y'all really giving me the insight. Like, I can feel the angle now. I can't Here's too. the angle. Here's the angle. And I also see why the professors stood on their ground. Okay. Because what they're, in essence, saying is the last vestige or the last haven of true free speech is on college campus. That's so, what they want you to think. And he just set the scenario up. 
these professors are in on it. They're in on it to, to, to think that that's, just, that's their last straw to pull together this big fluffed uh, peacock feather like a big bad bird to say, we'll shut your freedom of speech down. We'll shut you down and put you back in slavery. We're the Jews. We're the small hats. Uh oh. <laughs> we can do it. We can do it. We, you can't do nothing against God. Try to do it. Remember recompense every time they make that move on us. Watch. For making that move right there, watch what the Lord do to them. If we're going to see them, that's how they're going to go down. Every time they make a stance and jump toward us, God going to knock their legs out from under. We're going to see them fall on their face, man. Watch. Watch and see. And you know what the prophecies say. So this is what we're going to see them making strikes and moves and jumping at us and making little postures and gestures like they so tough, you know, stunting. We're going to see them doing that as God take them down, man, because you know what the, the prophecy is. We, they in the prophecy now and still jumping at us, man. They going to got to go take care of business what their business is with the most high first. They're going to be the first ones, the second ones to leave the scene. After they wiped off the strip, man, they, 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 hey, the next country to drop, you shouldn't have called yourself a country. You called yourself the wrong country. The Most High is knocking us off the map. We went down. Daniel and them had to go to Lions Den. Hebrew boys had to go to the fiery furnace. We had to go into slavery. All them slaves, all them thousands of years. From the beginning of the time to the end of time, we were in slavery to these nations, man. And they think they're going to just get to walk. Edomites think they're just going to walk away without getting their punishment. They bring down. They're going to just go up in heaven through the gates, bust through the gates. They ain't got no name on the gates or nothing. Just knock through, knock past Jesus and the angels. Let us up in here. We had y'all enslaved that we down there. We the nations. No, it ain't gonna happen. Not like that. So all praises to the most high. We hope we said something that might open somebody's eyes. Cause all I'm saying is we free. We got this hopeful hopefully this will start that gathering up talk. Because they are saying you better not preach another word on the streets in these small hats, in these big brims. We're going to beat y'all's butt. We're going to do you just like we did them people over there with our bombs. Going to bomb you. You don't have a God. Look, we're playing in your God's face. We're in his land stomping on his portholes. City of God. Yeah, all right. We're going to dig tunnels under here. We're going to cave in all of America. If we can't have it, nobody will. Hey, man, y'all don't know what's under them tunnels, what's in them tunnels, man. Y'all don't know what those tunnels are for. And the police and that, all that red herring stuff and all that acting and tearing up benches, at the best, they were trying to destroy evidence before. But, you know, before uh, some kind of investigation, crew get in there and start... You know, you ain't even going to be able to walk in there and do no fingerprints, no blood samples or nothing. You ain't going to be able to do none of that. That place probably burned down, man. Plus, the New York City, the New York City, man, they're in on it. They are, the, they are them people, the whole law, the prosecutors. That's their relatives. That's their grandfathers and all of that. That's where they live. That's who they are. That's who they are, man. All the lawyers, attorneys, all their attorneys. All those black robes, man, that's them. That's their family down there. You, you, and, and six police with that mob, that was their family. How you know that wasn't their sons and daughters in them uniforms? They weren't worried about nobody attacking them. So all praises to the Most High. Hope we can gather up and gather this information up and start thinking we got to get together and stick together because... Shit about to hit the fan, man. <laughs> All praise to the most high. Shalom.